river also helps you calculate uh, variances automatically. So if you look at it, I have uh, three columns here. My actuals for 2022, actuals for 2021, and plan for 2022, right? Now, if I need to calculate variances, the standard method is uh, you go to an insert formula, and then you can calculate these variances, but uh, you can handle them a little bit more easier. Um, you get uh, to see these items, you know, prior year plan and forecast. And when you, let's say, I move this to prior year, and the report actually doesn't change, but when you go to manage columns, you're going to see two additional fields. And this got created only after I assigned this to uh, this particular value. And one of them is uh, the absolute variance and the second one is percentage variance. So I can just enable that um, and it automatically shows up in that particular uh, order. And I can also move around these columns if I want, but uh, InfoRiva calculates variances for you automatically. Now, similarly, if I move this to plan, uh, it's going to show me four more uh, because uh, there is a variance for plan with respect to 2021 actual, sorry, uh, plan with respect to 2022 actuals and also variances for these two, right? But we don't want to enable all of them by default. So that's why it's usually hidden. And usually when you split them out, you don't have to calculate uh, variances on your own.